Early break in the second. 6-2 and now two love. <laughs> and really, Patrick, it doesn't seem as though Jimmy has been able to get a rhythm going at all. No, he hasn't been able to do that. He hasn't been able to get the crowd into it yet. Seems a bit resigned at this point, but can never, ever think like that when you're playing Jimmy Connors. Oh, <laughs> Great positioning from John. Got in really tight after that serve. It's one thing he says that has slowed down a little bit, his ability to get in quickly after the serve, but he's got a lot of energy flowing now. That's textbook right there. Swing the serve out wide, get in quick, volley to the open court. That was wide. Pressure on Connors. Second serve here. Good one into the body. John thought he got good depth on that. He did, but the ball bounced up high. Jimmy rips it. A lot more approaches for Mac. 15. They only won seven out of 15, but a lot of times, Bill, it's just putting that in your opponent's mind that you're going to keep coming in. I think that's forced a lot of errors from Connors. Talking to the crowd, John waits. John has really taken his time in this game in particular, and the last game, Bill, that he served, that first game in the second set. He knows how crucial it is to not let Jimmy sneak through the door and get back in this. Never relax when you're playing Connors. Tremendous serve out wide and the fist pump again. Fifth ace. And all coming at crucial moments in this match today, Bill. serve well back with more from the quality challenge in a moment Monday on CBS it's an all-star comedy lineup beginning with Cosby followed by the King of Queens starring Kevin James and Jerry Stiller and everybody loves Raymond followed by Becker starring Ted Danson then on 48 hours mysteries a mother finally confronts the man who murdered her daughter that's Monday on CBS <laughs> Connors trying to find some answers. And, uh, he's had the opportunities, but every time he's had them, John McEnroe's closed the door. Oh, another tremendous down the line winner for McEnroe. We've seen a few of them off the backhand, and now the forehand starting to flow. The early preparation here from John, the racket back. Tremendous control. Oh, really hitting with so much confidence. Is John back on the right now? You know when he's hitting that forehand well from the back of the court, Bill, and going after the ball. 
And he's feeling very confident. Connor is now in danger of this match being over. Real quick. Opportunity on the second serve. Connors not able to find the rhythm. And it's all been about capitalizing on opportunities in this match. And in that sense, it's been all Mac. Double break play. And another break for McEnroe. Well, Monday on CBS, not only have critics called Everybody Loves Raymond one of the 10 best shows of the year, they've also called it one of the 100 greatest TV shows of all time. Find out why Monday at 9, 8 Central, right here on CBS. So Connor's continuing to struggle, and Patrick, you just wonder, is it what John is doing right or what Jimmy's doing wrong? Well, I think as it started out, it was more what John was doing right, but I think... Jimmy's just gotten flustered. Look at the errors. Connor's nine already in four games and down only four. Sign as Matt Cam shows clearly, but John didn't let it bother him. Came right back and played an exquisite volley. Connor just has not looked himself in this second set, Bill. Taking a page from the uh, Connors textbook, mm -hmm. scrambling around, getting to everything. Really, he's really retrieved incredibly well. And taking another page from the textbook of Connors, taking plenty of time, going to the towel, making sure he's fresh for each point. More leniency in the time between points <laughs> on the senior tour, Bill. said he promised uh, his wife Patty that he was going to be calm today because it's Father's Day <laughs> and after what occurred a year ago <laughs> Kevin looks on she sent Kevin to keep an eye on him that's right John has been able to do that it hasn't hurt that he's only lost two games Bill <laughs> <laughs> but he's come out with an incredible focus today Six two, six three. Yep. There's a lot of golf with his dad. Connor showing some life in this game. Couple of break chances here. Looks 
guess I should remind everyone, Bill, as much as it hurts me, some of the comebacks that Connors has had, of course, against yours truly at the Open, when I had two sets to love and a break in the third. Connors beat me in the first round, went on to this, his glorious run that year, the semis. One year he's down against Pern Fours at Wimbledon, 6-1, 6-1, 4-1. Sixth for McEnroe, so I know it's what I speak it when I say that don't take it easy on Connors when you got a lead on him. I learned the hard way. Here's another big delivery up the middle. And I suspect your brother is all too aware of that as well. Six aces now for Mack, only one for Jimmy. Lob was scrambling again. John then gets back into the rally, takes the pace off it to the Connors forehand. Once again, returning from double break point down. Remember, Connors had three break points in the first game of this set. Seven great points saved in this match by Mack. No call. Jimmy frustrated. Can't believe that he didn't get a call. Uh, take a look at the Mac cam. Ball clearly over the baseline. Going Jimbo's way. No overrule from the chair. No overrule from the chair. Game point now. There's another ace. Seven for John McEnroe. In control at the challenge. 